morning. Okay. So this is that day in between Good Friday and Easter. There you go. Is that called Palm Sunday? Probably. Maybe. I'm not sure. Anyway, today is Saturday. Not Friday nor Sunday. It's coffee day. Coffee morning. It's uh, overcast, raining, and five degrees. It's supposed to get quite warm this afternoon when the sun comes out. Mm. Yeah, I look forward to that. Actually, what's pleasing me now is the, the warmth of my coffee, not the actual taste of it. It doesn't taste good. I, um, I forgot. I forgot when I was putting my clothes out last night that I don't have that bank of hoodies that I have had hanging there for months that I put them away yesterday because of company and stuff like that. So I put most of my clothes out, but that's counting on just grabbing a hoodie. We all know. So I had to sneak into the bedroom and you know, open the closet and sort of just grab anything, which I couldn't see. So I have this nice form sweater, whatever, spool of hair, because we don't use a dryer, so the hair stays on when you wash it even, so I don't wear it out. So, it's not what I wanted to wear, but it doesn't really matter. It's keeping me warm. Sitting here, doing my work, which I haven't started yet. It's 8.25. I'm not due to start until 9. I'm having my coffee, checking my emails, doing my morning stuff, and then I'll get to work. Mm. So, yesterday went well. Mm. See, I was worried. This thing wouldn't have pockets, but of course it has pockets. I love pockets. That's what I like about hoodies. They have that, you know, pouch in the front. I never use the hood, but they have the pouch in the front. That is why I look like hoodies. The pouch. Anyway, yesterday went well. So, who came over? my kids and my daughter's boyfriend and my husband's nephew and his girlfriend. So we were seven and no one had seen the completed bathroom yet so they were quite pleased by it. My mom was polite, quite pleased by it. It's not, you know, completely completed, but good enough. It makes a big difference compared to to what they're used to. So that was a hit. And then my husband made pad thai. He's been working, he's been practicing his pad thai. And uh, he made that for, for dinner last night, so that was a hit. My pictures didn't turn out that well. I posted them on Facebook. 
but they didn't, they didn't turn out that well. Oh. Nope, nope, nope. I was disappointed. But then, you know, I have a, just an ordinary camera. And the pictures came out pretty darn ordinary. I used a flash. They still came out ordinary. Okay, so I don't have much to say. <laughs> because I'm thinking about getting to work. So I guess I should get to work because it's on my mind. And I thought of something last night. Something that I should have my students do. And life of me, I can't remember what I thought of. What am I going to have them doing in the spiral of things? Darn. Well, it'll come to me. I'll look back at what they've been doing and I'll remember that that's what I wanted them to do. Okay, well, whatever. I obviously can't do anything while I have... Did you know that you couldn't multitask? You can't multitask. It's just not possible for the brain to truly multitask. I think I've talked about this before, right? You can only put something on the back burner and concentrate on something more, but truly multitask? No. Doesn't work. So, I should stop trying. Thinking and talking? No, not going to work. Not this morning and not if I haven't finished my coffee yet. Okay, I'll talk to you later.